Heading over the hill with a lot of troops. Still epic even to watch. Hello, Christian Pulsifer here with another Xbox clip. This time it's an ESO or Elder Scrolls Online for those of you who do not know. Yeah, this is a fun game. But that's not why I'm doing this video. Right now I'm doing this video to to just pretty much share my thoughts on the recently announced uh, mouse and keyboard support coming to Xbox One and even PS4. Even PS4. Well, uh, technically, it's not really a it's not a real keyboard for the PS4. They just it's just you know buttons that are mapped in a way that you know it would feel like a a keyboard. But anyway, Xbox One's getting this mouse and keyboard support. And I've been looking at a bunch of other videos on YouTube about other people's thoughts about the whole mouse and keyboard thing. Some were negative, some were positive. So here's what I think. Um, as a person who plays on, on the Xbox with a controller, well, I've, I've been playing with controller ever since, ever since friggin' N64. And the few times that I've actually used a keyboard for gaming, um, you know, I've, I mean, I played Doom and Wolfenstein. I've even played Halo 2 on on the PC. And I've played Crisis. <laughs> which, you know, I've never tried online multiplayer on the PC until um until Crisis 3. And you know, for someone who's been using a controller for a vast majority of his gaming life, you know, it's you know, I prefer a controller over keyboard. But this whole, the, the whole mouse and keyboard issue for Xbox One, um, you know, we haven't really seen much of the whole thing. We haven't seen, we haven't seen this mouse and keyboard thing demoed. And that's pretty much the thing. People are basing their their opinions on something they have not fully th we have we have not seen a preview for the mouse and keyboard support. I would like to see this preview. Who knows? Maybe it Maybe it's the best idea ever. Maybe it's the worst idea ever. But even still, I would love to see a preview of the whole of the whole preview on for the mouse and keyboard thing. Same thing for I would, I would like to see Sony also preview their their new sort of mouse and keyboard controller thing. I mean, the mouse for their, for the PS4 thing, you know, it, it's definitely a mouse. <laughs> I mean, it has the PlayStation, it has some of the PlayStation buttons on it, which is cool. But still, I would, I would like to see a preview of that thing <laughs> as well.
and really... If... And people are... Pe some people have been saying that if it was a thing for, like, um, first-person shooters to have full native mouse and keyboard support, that, you know, they would want... Pe they would want people who are using these things to be separated from the people who are using the controllers. You know what I say? I say just put them all together. Yeah, put them together and and stuff because if you really think about it, the people who are who have been playing on con playing with controllers for years like I have or people who have who've been using keyboards for years like like um myoelectric or um uh what's a good example of a PC gamer I don't know I don't know I don't know too many PC games I don't watch very many PC gamers on um, YouTube. Well, I guess Amanda on the Run would be one. Uh, well, anyway, any PC gamer who's been using a mouse and keyboard for years as much as a person on consoles playing with controllers for years I I think they would have an equal chance at getting at each other yeah I want to yeah I want to see these people meet the people who are using the controllers because, at and the people using keyboards, I. Because everyone has actually been basing their opinions on the fact that the, the whole mouse, precision thing. I call bullcrap on that because. Um. Because of my experience, playing Crisis Three. It's not because the game sucks. It the game doesn't really suck at all. And I do have a PC controller. As a matter of fact, now that I think about it, I have multiple PC controllers. Cuz the Xbox One controllers can you you just need to download a driver and uh and install it and then there you go. Anyway, yeah. Anyway, I played I played better with a controller better than a keyboard. So, I say put them all together and see what happens. In fact, in fact, try starting up a uh, something small so that you know who's playing with what. Controller or keyboard. And base your opinions on that rather than make it rather than spouting your PC console hate issues. That's all I got. I'm going to let the rest of this gameplay go. It's not very exciting, but... This is my first experience in uh, ESO PvP, and I loved it. See you later.